We have some breaking news in the NFL world revolving around the Detroit Here we go. Lions. As of this morning, the Lions have announced with no E that Martha <laughs> Firestone Ford. So hold on. Let me get this straight. Uh, Firestone Tires and Ford, same family? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Jeez. Damn. That's got to be. Nope. Bro, that has to be a good time to just have. What, money falling literally out of every crevice, mm -hmm. including the crack of your ass at that point? Mm -hmm. Good for Martha Firestone Ford. She is stepping down as principal owner of the team. Her daughter, Sheila Ford Hamp, will take over. Shout out to Sheila Hamp. Here she is now the owner of the Detroit Lions. Foxy is a diehard yep. Detroit Lions fan. I think a lot of people have said, hey, she needs to step down. Okay, she needs to step down. We need, we need somebody else's brain in there. We got the same coaching staff as last year, same front office as last year, but now we have a new owner. What's going to change, Foxy, and how do you feel? Tuesday, June 23rd, Pat, this is it. The Detroit dynasty has started. I'm 25 years old. I've never seen a playoff win. Martha, see you later. Oh. Get out of town. Hello, Sheila. If you talk to anyone, they say, what's the problem with the Lions? And it's always been ownership. Now we got a new one. No offense, what's Martha. Same owner. Yeah, same. It's same, it's same exact owner. Same owner. family. Yeah. Actually, no. was born and no. raised in the Martha no. business. No. 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 So no, he's going to act the same exact way as Martha. It's just her daughter taking over the day to day now. No, no, that's not. How Martha was ninety four <laughs> years old. Pat, you don't think what Sheila's potentially going to? You think Sheila's going to want the Lions to win, or you think Sheila's potentially wanting the Lions Sheila out of the family? Know, Sheila knows that we have Thanksgiving football every single year, and she also knows winning. This is the year I get to see a playoff win, Pat. Here we go. Sheila Ford Hamp comes in in relief of her mother. Uh, and Detroit Lions fans now, if Evan Foxy is the depiction of all of them, yep. think that this is the turning point for the Detroit Lions franchise to become a dynasty yet again. Good for you, Foxy, on believing that. Everybody deserves to have a little bit of hope. I think everybody outside of Detroit is going, Oh, so this is just a transition of power <laughs> to the next generation. Yeah, well, they don't know. Classic nepotism. Mm -hmm. It'll be easier yeah. to fire Classic. Patricia. That's all it is. Oh. Well, that's our guy. All right, that's a, you watch your mouth, all right? Hey, listen, Matt Patricia knows that he 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 even said that he didn't expect to be the head coach right now, but now that he's got another year in there, maybe a little bit. You guys got rid of Jim Caldwell after he won some games. Mm -hmm. Said, hey, not enough. I, Martha I said, not enough, Jim Caldwell. You look like you're on the sideline always keeping calm, cool demeanor. It's not calm, cool here in Detroit. Everything's burning down. Have a little bit of emotion. Let's get rid of him. So then you bring in Matt Patricia, our guy. By the way, Jim Caldwell, my guy. Matt Patricia, our guy. Yep. You bring him in. He doesn't have much emotion on the sideline either. No. He's got his pencil. He's just kind of hanging out. If they don't win this year, I'll be excited to see what move Sheila makes because she's probably had an envision of what the line should be. Look for potentially new logos, yeah. new oh. uniforms, oh. new daily game oh. operations. Oh. She's been sitting back behind Martha this whole time like, oh, I think we could do this better. We could do this better. We could do this better. Or she's been there alongside Martha the entire time saying, good decision, good decision, <laughs> good decision. And then that will mean that there's literally nothing happening at all in this entire thing or she's saying i hate this team and she sells them to amazon yep oh jeff bezos yeah. by the way could come in and buy the detroit lions More the detroit be. tigers the detroit red wings and the detroit pistons <laughs> but if you're jeff bezos why would you do that mm -hmm. <laughs> bezos says, uh, he's made a career out of good decision making oh, oh. 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 what's up foxy oh, oh she loves you think um sheila's husband i looked it up steven hamp Gets made fun of at all the uh, family barbecues for not having a billion dollar company <laughs> named after him, or D does he not? I would Firestone and Ford. Like I would assume that Stephen Hamp is not just some. I, I would assume whenever is that the Hamptons, the Firestone and the Fords families come together, that there is some sort of I don't want to say selection pool on who you're allowed to marry, but I would assume you don't just let some stooge in the family. I, I would assume Mr. Hamp has done a little something, or by the way, his name would now be Stephen Firestone Ford. <laughs> <Exactly>. <laughs> he would take her name if he has it. I would assume. I think he started. Started all the Hampton Inns. Uh -uh. I'm pretty uh, sure. It's saying here he is a uh, he's a Michigan grad. Oh, he stinks. Uh, he stinks. <laughs> good school, but he stinks. Just, just, just for venture capitalist means he invests money. Okay. It's funny that that was real strong. <laughs> Uh, he's around a lot of money, Mr. Hamp. But Michigan, by the way, gets a bad rap, obviously, for a lot of reasons. Yeah. Ann Arbor was gorgeous. Good school. I have never it's seen a nice. university like that before. It, there was just Bentleys parked in the front of houses, mm -hmm. and these students were just having the time of their life. I was like, damn, I understand why if you go to Michigan, yeah. you want to let everybody know you went to Michigan, exactly. because that experience up there was insane. Yeah, I'm a Michigan State guy. I'm supposed to hate Michigan, but it is very nice, and they know it, and they will let you know. Yeah, and, uh, and to be fair, Michigan State stinks, so. Uh, come on. So.
Come on. Maybe uh, maybe Sheila will save Michigan State too. You oh, know what I mean? Oh, maybe yeah. maybe this will be ah, they, maybe this will be your god. I maybe. woke up. <laughs> I woke up wearing this Honolulu blue. Knew it was gonna be a good day. Attaboy. This is it. Attaboy. This Honolulu is it. blue. That's what it's called. Yeah. All right.